with highs in the upper 50s. Tonight, 40 in Mobile, 41 in Daphne, a few upper 30s in the inland spots, but most of us in the 40s tonight, especially from I-10 southward. 44 in Gulf Shores, we'll call it clear and chilly. The Panhandle dry and cool and uh, into the mid-40s coastal, upper 30s in the inland spots from Crestview and on over towards Century. Inland areas uh, could see a little patchy frost here and there, but I think tomorrow night will be a lot frostier. We'll be at 35 in Jackson, 35 in Thomasville with clear skies and cold conditions and mainly clear skies from Leaksville to Loosedale with a one or two clouds out there. 42 in Pascagoula. Here's your outlook for your Thanksgiving day. And we're tracking a day uh, that's going to be very, very pretty. We'll see a lot of sun. But our temperatures will be limited by a north wind. And we'll have a little breeze tomorrow, too. It's going to be out of the north at about 10 to 15 miles an hour in the afternoon. So we'll call it a cool 58, a couple of degrees chillier than it was today. Still real nice, though. And most of us are inside eating and laying around the house anyway. Looking at the extended forecast, cold on Thursday night down to 33. Friday at 59 degrees for Black Friday. No problems for shopping on Friday. You know, it's a big shopping day for those who are brave enough to head out to the stores. I will not be doing that, but I know there's a lot of folks who really enjoy shopping on Friday, and it's a tradition and all of that, and we're going to see great weather. Iron Bowl Saturday. How about the forecast for the big game? Well, you know, the Iron Bowl this year is at night uh, in Tuscaloosa, and you would think it would probably be pretty cold, but actually it's uh, going to be a pretty mild situation. Looking at the night planner, the game planner for the Iron Bowl, we're talking about temperatures in the upper 50s dropping to the mid 50s. So it's still a little ways off, but already thinking about making plans for cooking out or heading up to the big game on Saturday should be no problems. It gets even milder for the rest of the weekend too. We hit 73 degrees on Sunday and no significant rain between now and Wednesday of next week. What a nice quiet forecast for the Thanksgiving holiday weekend.